Bianca, where have you been? Let's go with me. Bianca, where have you been? For those of you who would meet me and ask me, be on court, where have you been? It's been two years. Two exact years. One year ago, I posted a video saying that I would come back. And then it was just downhill from there. So I was not back for that year, last year. But now, I think I'm back and if I'm not back fully then I am back to be posting videos off and on off and on off and on welcome back to my channel guys I know it's been a long year it's been it may be not even something like two years but it's been two years um since I started this channel and then I just go MIA but hey I am back and I will explain to you all where have I been before we get into the rest of this video don't forget to like comment subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and stay tuned for the rest of it. so guys <laughs> welcome back to my channel <laughs> where do I start where do I begin how do I explain myself so in 2022 I took a break from my video making videos and then I said I would be back in 2023 so 2023 I came and I made a video saying that I was back on my channel and then this dreadful 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 moment happened I I don't even know if I can talk about it without shedding a tear all those things and it was just downhill i am still going through that phase and where do i begin so first of all um first of all like i was saying i went to the doctor i cannot remember when i went to the doctor it's been some years and okay so i went to the doctor in 2022 for a food handler's permit and then the secretary is telling me but we have a document there for you mark you i went to the doctor to do some tests because of some pain i was feeling in my stomach and they said they would call me when my results came back after i did the test so when my results came back i was looking forward for somebody calling me nobody never called when i called the office they were saying the results is not ready or this kind of other things. So after a while of calling, 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 I just stopped calling. And then 2022, I went to the doctor to do some tests for a food handler's permit. And the secretary told me, but Miss Libla, we have your results there. We from, and that was like a year ago or whatever. Um, you don't want the doctor to see you to tell you to read you the results and whatever whatever and from time you hear the doctor have to read you the results and the secretary kind of tell you okay everything is okay you know something bad so i tell her okay so when you're going to do your test for your food and the doctor will just um do the results for you so when i went into the doctor's office the doctor told me it's been a while so he's going to send me and the results didn't come back good I had a bacteria in my stomach and bacteria doesn't really dis disappear like that so he's going to send me to redo the test and then um, to see if it's still there and treat me so he sent me to redo the test I got it back one time the, the, the bacteria was still there so he gave me some medication antibiotics to take for first month and then he told me after the first month you have to wait two weeks and then to redo the test and then 
if it's still there then you'd have to go back on more antibiotics if it's not there then you would just have to continue living your life like normal then fine it's not there that was december for january i started taking the antibiotics as for the whole month of january february i did the test again the bacteria was still there so i had to go back and take more antibiotics may march i did the test and i still had to continue taking the antibiotics april the test came back saying that it was everything was good so i was happy about that so for three months of 2023 the uncle was on antibiotics but that's not the dreaded part me going to the doctor and finding out i was i have a bacteria in my stomach and all those things it's not the dreaded part about 2023 that make me didn't post videos from the one that i posted in january last year the most dreadful thing that could happen to me for 2023 and the reason why i wanted 2023 to just end I lost my grandmother February 2nd 2023 I lost the most important person in my life my favorite favorite person on this earth <sighs> that dreaded Thursday night when my auntie called me and tell me the hospital called her <laughs> it has just been downhill when i tell you of downhill i mean downhill from there downhill 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 but i'm not going to give you all the story in that video i'm going to give it to you in the next video so stay tuned for the next video don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on your post notifications so you get a notification every time i post a video and stay tuned for the next video because that's where i will tell you all the story about the day my auntie called me and tell me the hospital called her and <laughs> parts of the story my auntie don't even know because i never told her what happened but she would have watched my youtube videos big up to your auntie so she will get to know what really happened when she called me trust me <laughs> bear with me in the video yeah because trust me it's going to be a hard a hard video to do a hard 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 video to do believe me believe me i am trying to keep it together even now believe me believe me believe me it's going to be a hard video but stay tuned i am back guys i am not back i'm not going to guarantee you this time that i am back to post every other day or every week but i can guarantee you i can post you one or two videos for the month in 2024 january starts and january is ending so this is one video for january but stay tuned see you guys in the next video <laughs>